everybody. I'm standing outside of RSA Conference in San Francisco, California, where Cisco is showing top cybersecurity professionals just how we're revolutionizing security. But let's head inside and hear from G2 Patel's keynote. The data centers themselves will need to get fundamentally reimagined to go out and accommodate for these additional AI workloads and digital workers. But it's not just the data centers that'll need to be reimagined. What you'll also have to reimagine is the underlying infrastructure for security that's gonna go out and power these data centers. With Cisco and Splunk coming together, we can now offer a comprehensive security solution so organizations can connect and protect all that they do. We're so excited to have Splunk join our Cisco family. But let's hear more about that greatness from Tony Patera. I'm fortunate enough to have started my career with Cisco back in 2005, so in some ways this is a bit like coming home. Some of the things that we've introduced at RSA are things like asset and risk intelligence. This gives Splunk and Cisco a great way to use the power of the network, combined with the power of Splunk's security analytics to give customers an unprecedented level of visibility. Cisco Identity Intelligence is available now in Cisco Duo to protect organizations against identity-based attacks. With Cisco HyperShield, the industry's first AI-native security architecture, customers will now be able to protect against both known and unknown zero-day exploits. Let's go chat with Craig Connors to learn more about it. AI is baked into every level at HyperShield. It starts with a graph engine that's running in every agent, where we're feeding in information about the network and the processes we're monitoring and using AI to crunch that down to the most important data. And also, as we announced yesterday, to look for patterns of malicious behavior like unknown vulnerabilities that might be present in the graph. We send that to a control plane agent where we enrich that with all of our different observation points, as well as information about the software bill of materials and other information to help us build a full picture of the application. That's a wrap on RSA Conference 2024. For more content like this, check out newsroom.cisco.com and I'll see you in the next video.